Hey guys and welcome back to the channel. Today in this short video I'm going to be talking about time and its relationship with making money. More specifically, doubling your money. It is a concept that's going to make you look so smart you're going to be the centre of attention at parties. Because you know, mathematical rules and equations is what everybody talks at at parties, right? What I'm talking about is known as the rule of 72. Stay with me because this rule is pretty useful when it comes to your investment journey. But before we get going, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to be notified when I release future videos. And if you get any value from this video at all, please hit the like button to help spread the word further. So the rich get richer, but why? Well, you could argue it's because they're better connected, they have more privilege, or money was just handed down to them by past generations. While these things can certainly play a role, I would argue that the reason rich people are able to grow their money is because they have knowledge. They understand money concepts, and when they are applied, it's gonna multiply their wealth. And one of these concepts or rules is the rule of 72. Put simply, the rule of 72 is a quick mathematical formula that you can use to accurately estimate the number of years that are required to double your investment. And this can apply to many things, including population growth rates, GDP, inflation, and most importantly for you and I, investment growth. It gives you a tangible time frame for how long it's gonna to take to double your money. So you can analyze whether an investment is right for you based on the returns that you're likely to expect to get. So the formula for this rule is 72 divided by the expected annual rate of return, which equals the number of years it takes to double. It's important to know that the time frame for your return and the time frame that it takes to double are correlated. So in this case, we're gonna go with an annual rate of return and how many years it takes to double. So let's take a look at three examples where you can apply this rule that will help you make a decision on where to keep your money. So let's say you have 5,000 pounds and you wanna grow your money, obvs, and it'd be nice to double your money. So how long will it take to do that? So in this example, firstly, you leave your money in a savings account. You're gonna get an interest rate of about 1% in this account. In our second example, you get a 3% return. So let's say you're investing in the stock market, but you're heavily weighted towards bonds. And in the final example, you're invested in equities or stocks, and you're expecting a return of around 7%. So with a 1% return, the equation is 72 divided by one, meaning it's gonna take you 72 years to double your 5,000 pound and turn it into 10 grand. The number of times that I talk to people and they say to me they keep all their money in a savings account because it's safe. Hmm, 72 years doesn't sound that safe to me. Okay, so with a 3% return, Again, we divide 72 by three, which tells us it's gonna take 24 years to double your money from 5,000 to 10,000 pounds. And finally, if we expected a 7% return, we divide 72 by, you guessed it, seven. And we would expect to have 10,000 pounds in about 10.2 years. Now I use a 7% return as an example here because it's a pretty standardized accepted return to expect if you invested in equities within the stock market. And truthfully, if you've seen any of my portfolio update videos, you're gonna know that I have returned significantly more than that in the last couple of years. So I'm being pretty cautious with the numbers, but it's important to remember that past performance is not an indication of future returns, but it's the only data that we have to make predictions. So we have to rely on it to some degree. So I'm gonna to continue to expect higher returns than 7% based on how I currently invest, meaning I will double my money much quicker than 10 years. And the beauty of this rule is that it works regardless of the value of money you have invested. Whether you have 1,000 pound invested or 1 million, you can use the rule of 72 to work out how long it's gonna to take to double your money. And this is what the rich and wealthy understand. Now obviously doubling 1 million pounds is more attractive than doubling 1,000, but you have to start somewhere and you certainly need to beat inflation, especially in times like this. So I hope I gave you something to think about and you can thank me in the comment section below for arming you with some really great icebreakers for your next party. Before you go anywhere though, please hit that like button and I'll see you in the next video.